What's going on guys? Welcome back to a Madden 22 video. And this video is gonna be more about building your squad. I'm gonna give you guys the top three offensive players for your team, budget version, and then people that have an unlimited budget. I'm gonna give you the two lists. Now, before I get started, I wanna say thank you guys for all the support. You guys have been going crazy on YouTube. If you haven't already subbed, hit the sub button. And if this video gets 500 likes before the end of the day, I will drop the defensive version tomorrow. All right, let's jump into it. I'm going to start off with the player that's on both lists, the budget and non-budget lists, and that's going to be the quarterback position. It's 84 overall, Justin Fields. Um, I believe, in my opinion, he is the best quarterback in the game right now. He's 87 speed, hits all the throws. He has 88 throw power, um, short accuracy is 80. Mid accuracy is 78, deep accuracy is 81. I haven't had a ton of inaccurate throws from him. He does miss sometimes, but I see Josh Allen do the same thing, who happens to be the meta quarterback right now with set feet lead. I personally like the ability to run and get out of the pocket at a fast rate, and he has 87 speed, and it, and it's just, it, you can see the difference when you use him compared to someone like Josh Allen who's in the seven, like high 70s as far as speed goes. Now, Justin Fields, 84 overall. I don't imagine him being the best mobile quarterback for much longer. I feel like they're gonna release somebody within the next couple of weeks. Uh, but as of right now, he's, he's usable. And even when there's another quarterback that comes out that's maybe better ratings wise, he's still gonna be usable. In my opinion, he's still usable right now. You don't need the abilities as of right now, but if Hot Route Master, Escape Artist, stuff like that starts coming out, then you want to say, okay, let me take a look at those. But as of right now, Fields, 46K, 50K, um, I would definitely go out and get him. It's the most important position on your team. Again, this is for anyone from someone who has a limited budget to a, a 2 million coins sitting in their account. Fields, quarterback number one, in my opinion. All right. Budget number two on my list. All right, we're gonna go through this list uh, and then we're gonna get to the guys with the more budget, all right? So if you're on a budget, you have a couple hundred thousand coins um, and you wanna you know, make sure that you're starting this, this, this mutt journey and building your team off on the right foot, there's a couple of cards that you can get for free, all right? Jamar Chase is the next card up. He is unlocked at mutt level 10, He's 93 speed on my team. Again, the speed rating is uh, adjusted because I have the strategy cards. His jump is good. Uh, his catch is good enough, in my opinion. He does actually, you know what? I take that back. He does drop a little bit more passes than everyone on my team, but it's not really something like I'm noticing every single game, but I have seen him drop some passes. All right, deep route runs 85. There's his ratings. Um, the thing that sets Jamar Chase apart is really his speed. And I will say this, he is not a budget card if you don't get him at mud level 10 or you have the rookie premier tokens to unlock him. He becomes, you know, an expensive card. He's probably going for 250K right now or so. And, and so is the player at number three. But the reason he's on the budget list is because you unlock him for free at mud level 10. And then if you did the sets, the rookie premier sets from last year from Madden 21, you also unlock him um uh, via those tokens all right so jamar chase would be the number two spot as of right now and again we, we can talk about you know his how much he goes for i'll just give you guys an idea like if you guys that you know do have the the coins to get him you know you took someone else for your month level 10 and you have coins laying around you want a fast receiver not named hester chase is available um, he's just going to cost you a decent amount of coins. Uh, and you'll see it right now. I would imagine 250-ish. Jamar Chase, 260. All right, so you're going to get the speed. But you're also going to spend a little bit. But if you do have the Mutt Level 10, make sure you use it there. And then if you have Rookie Premieres, you could get this next guy as well. So you get both of these cards for free, potentially. Um, and the next card is Kyle Pitts. Kyle Pitts, tight end. He offers something that no tight end currently offers besides him, and that's uh, being six foot six and on top of that, 88 speed. Uh, he's amazing. His catch is good. Uh, 
I don't notice him dropping the ball. Um, his short route runs 82, mid route runs 80. Run block, not that great, but again, is it noticeable? I would probably say no. All right, Kyle Pitts, 86 overall rookie premier. Again, you can get this guy for free at Mutt Level 10, or if you have your rookie premier sets done and if you still have those available, you could get him. Now we'll go look at what he costs on the auction house. If you do not have that stuff available, you can get him still, but it's gonna cost you some coins. I would assume it's around the same, if not just a tad bit more than Chase. We'll see here, Pitts currently going for Kyle Pitts a little bit under 300K. All right, so those guys can get up there if you don't have the free my level 10 or the rookie premier sets. All right, so there's your budget, guys. Let's talk about the guys that have a bunch of coins. You've rip packs, you've sold your cards, you have a, a nice bankroll of coins, or you went on rockbottomcoins.com, use code PROD for 10% off, and you have coins uh, from there. Listen, if you have the coins, let's talk about these next three players that, uh, again, the first player that I think is on both lists is Fields coins or no coins budget or, or unlimited coins he's a must-have so there's two players that i want to talk about that you should be getting if you have the coins to do so all right i still think mccaffrey is amazing a couple weeks ago if you asked me or 10 days ago if you asked me five days ago if you asked me who the best player in mud is on offense mccaffrey was it however there is a new running back that just came out that is so shifty and you can tell he's so much faster than majority of the people that he's going to go against on defense Ladanian Tomlinson is that guy I'm going to show you his ratings he's powered up he has the same running back abilities as McCaffrey super good running back 91 speed so much faster 92 acceleration much more excel much uh one more in agility same catch out the backfield no same carry uh 88 to 86 catch is 71 so it's still good enough change of directions two more trucking is way more and break tackle is more lt is amazing um one thing that he doesn't have as good as mccaffrey though is his spin move it's just that doesn't make people miss as much but his shiftiness and his speed takes him over the edge in my opinion lt is a must-have for anybody that has the coins to get him i would go out and get a, a ladanian tomlinson now when i show you this price um just note that you also are gonna have to power him up with a bunch of training so you're gonna have to put towards training as well but his base price for his card and you can use this card if you like but you're not gonna get you're not gonna get the most out of it you know what i mean i, I would always advise you to, to power him all the way up um with just makes the most sense all right so 89 lt is going for 250k right now definitely think you should go out and get him if you have the coins to do so he's the best running back in my opinion now that he was he was released this past weekend uh with all the legends all right so we got fields lt for the spenders the last but not least for my guys that have the coins to do it is b marsh b marsh gets off the press so well he's six foot five for me he's 92 speed i have that plus two speed strategy cards 92 jump 92 catch 88 catch in traffic 92 spec catch short route runs 89 mid route runs 91 deep route runs 94 he is amazing across the board brandon marshall big body receiver definitely go out and get him if you have the coins to do so we're going to look at the price right now again note that if you want to power him all the way up and you see those ratings that you had i also have the strategy cards all right so take two speed off if you don't have the two strategy cards um, but if you want to power them up you're going to be spending a couple hundred thousand i would imagine in um in training all right at least 150k i would imagine in training so take note of that um brandon marshall on the block right now for 331 331 so for my budget guys i got fields and then the two rookie premieres that are free and then for my non-budget the guys that have a bunch of coins i got i still got fields and then we got lt and brandon marshall those are my must-haves right now on offense 
Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, remember, hit the like button. Let's get to 500 likes tonight. Thank you guys for all the love and support on the YouTube. You guys have been killing it. I can't thank you guys enough. I'll see you guys later. I'm on stream tonight, twitch.tv forward slash problem, right? Come through, let me know you watched the video. Let me know what you guys think. See you guys there. Peace.